Hello, good evening dear students. Today I am here to teach you naming angles. So students, as we all human beings have different names, likewise we can also name the angles in different ways. So before knowing about how to write the name of an angles, let's consider some points which we must consider while naming the angles so students please look at board some basic things while naming the angles so students the very first point which we need to consider while naming the angles is the symbol of the angle that how can we denote the angle so students the symbol the symbol angle is used to denote the angle so students while naming the angle always you should use the symbol of angle the symbol of angle is this this is the symbol of an angle while naming the angle, always you should use this symbol. With that theory, I angle ko naam lekhne bela ma, angle ko symbol prayog gandu parne uncha. Ra angle ko symbol bane ko, isto uncha. Point number two. Point number two is, capital letters are used to name the angles. So students, you have to be very careful while naming the angles always you must use capital letters while naming the angles capital letters are used while naming the angle So students, capital letters are used while naming the angles. With that theory, Amelie angle ko naam likhne bela ma capital letters ko prayog gandu parne uncha. Edi Amelie small letters use gari wane tiyo wrong una dancha. We must use capital letters. Point number three. Point number three is very important point related to vertex. So students, while naming the angles, always vertex of an angle is always written in the middle. Vertex of an angle. is always written in the middle so students vertex of an angle is always written in the middle as i have already told you what is vertex vertex is simply the common point the meeting point of the two arms while naming the angles vertex vertex must lies in the middle with that theory amile angle ko name likhne bela ma vertex jahile pani beech ma rakhnu parne huncha yadi amile vertex lai agadi ya pachadi rakhyo bhane tyo wrong huna jancha so students i hope you have understood 
these three basic things which we need to consider while naming angles so now let's see some example so students in exam you may ask in this way your question may arise like this name each of the following angles in two ways you may ask in this way your question question is asking you to write the name of given angles in two ways so let's take one example one angle so students here i have drawn one angle now you are supposed to write the name of this angle in two ways you have to write the name of this angle in two ways so how can we write the name of this angle in two ways so let's see so students here are the basic things which we had already considered which we had already considered so students look at first point the symbol angle is used to denote the angle so let's see the solution while naming the angle the very first thing you need to consider is you should keep the symbol of angle the symbol of angle is this this is the symbol of angle now come to point number 2 capital letters are used to name an angle while naming an angle always you should use capital letters as you can see in the question there are capital letters too so if you write x like this y like this and z in this way it will be wrong you are not supposed to use small letter always you should use capital letters and similarly point 3 vertex of an angle is always written in the middle so students point number 3 is very important while naming the angle your vertex your vertex must lies in the middle vertex la hamile beech ma lekhnu parne huncha so students as i have already told you in the previous class that an angle has got two arms your x y and y z they are the two arms x y arm and y z arm they have met at a common point which is known as y vidyarthiru x y ra y z arm y bhanne point ma bheteko cha jasko naam y cha tesaile y yaha vertex ho y bhaneko yo angle ko vertex ho र भर्टेक्सला हामीले जहिले पनि बिचमा राख्नु पर्ने हुन्छ हामीले भर्टेक्सलाई बिचमा राख्नु पर्ने हुन्छ यसको मतलब वाईलाई हामीले बिचमा राख्नु पर्ने हुन्छ वाईलाई हामीले बिचमा राख्नु पर्ने हुन्छ यसको मतलब हो हामीले अगाडि या त एक्स राख्नु पर्यो या त जेड राख्नु पर्यो सो स्टुडेन्ट्स लेट्स राइट सो वाई मस्ट लाइज इन द मिडल इट मिन्स नाउ यू हेव टू किप आइदर एक्स फर्स्ट or z first let's write angle x y 
z so students this is the angle of the name of this angle angle x y z you should keep symbol of an angle your all the letters should be in capital and similarly your vertex must lies in the middle vertex beach ma hunu pari now next see another way so students another way to name this angle is just we have to reverse before we wrote angle x y z now just reverse it now let's write the symbol of angle first angle now angle z y x angle z previously you had written x as first now you have to write z as first z y x so students here you can see we have fulfilled all the conditions the first con condition was the symbol of angle should be like this here we have written the symbol of angles capital letters are used to name an angle we have used capital letters similarly vertex of an angle is always written in the middle so students here y is your vertex you can see you can see y here is in the middle here also you can see y is in the middle so name this angle is angle x y z angle x y z or angle z y x angle z y x so students hope you have understood today's class very well this much for today in the next class we will continue the same chapter so this much for today thank you very much